Okay, AL. Oh boy. Here's here's our control panel here. We're going to start this up. And I'm going to show you over here. Show them their three pounds of pressure. I only do that for certain people. You got to have three pounds, see? Okay? Okay, keep on filming. Okay, we're going to start it up. We're going to start it up. And you see, got everything turned on right here. And free. See, I don't touch the carburetor. Okay, first thing we're going to do, um, we're going to do a, a high RPM test with a light load. Make sure everything works. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six gauges we're watching. They're all telling us something different. We're watching your vacuum stuff over here work. We're watching all that. Okay, now we're gonna now we're gonna turn on our this is the RPM meter. And we're gonna go back here and put the load on this thing here. This in here we're gonna put uh, this is a Chevrolet, that'd be medium load. This would be Buick and Cadillac. Okay. Now we're gonna what we're gonna do is we're gonna rev this engine up to see how much foot pounds of torque that carburetor will put out. This is with a load would be the equivalent of the car pulling a trailer with two flat tires on it. I mean, it would really be straining. But we're going to see what the capability of that carburetor is. i got to turn my cooling fans on here because it's starting to get a little warm. But here we go. Okay, we're already up there to 450. That'll really pull. I don't like that. It really scares me revving that dynamometer up that high. I just like to I like to be in some other room, but you can't do it. I guess you could put a rod on there and do it, but it just scares me. Anyway, there it is. It went clear over past 650. Let me go over here and turn that off. All hydraulic mechanism in there. Dino, dynamometer brake. Okay, we'll turn off all of these. All oh, boom. That's it. It's done. You're going to get this video sent to you. Okay.